Hey there, if you are stressed out about college admission procedure, you should probably spend two minutes watching this video. Hi guys, welcome to my channel and this is Shalu and today I am here to talk to you about something very very important and something I am currently facing and a lot of my other friends are facing and probably a lot of you are also facing. So I need to talk to you about college admission stress. For all those of you who are not living in Delhi and do not know the situation of Delhi University, I can probably explain to you this way. If you are scoring less than 95% in your class 12 boards in Delhi, uh, then you can just totally replace the Delhi University cutoff list with this small little slip that says and that's exactly the mindset a lot of kids right now in Delhi have and that is the very reason I am making this video because having that mindset is wrong. You will get stressed, you will have all this negative energy around you and uh, I definitely do not want all of that around you. So I am making this video with 5 reasons why you should not be stressed about the Delhi University cutoffs. Let's begin. So first of all, do not panic because panic is gonna cause more problems for you so last night what happened is there's this friend of mine and she was really really upset about the cutoffs and everything and she checked the list and she saw that she's making the cut in cut in some particular college but then today when she went to that college she realized she was not and she by mistake checked the list for 2015 2016 and that was just really sad so basically i want you guys not to panic and be calm about things because if you are going to panic right now, it is definitely, definitely going to create more trouble for you and you might miss out on opportunities or on colleges that you are making the cut. So please do not panic. Be cool and be calm about everything. Secondly, right now having the topmost college or the great college, the college with the best placement and everything would really seem very important. I mean, it is feel seeming like important to me as well but at the end of the day what matters is your caliber how much hard work and how much effort you put into your college and how you deal with your college i have seen people passing out from really amazing colleges top-notch colleges of delhi university and still they are jobless right now and also on the other hand i have these people passing out from ip universities who are doing commendable with your life also this is a myth that ip university sucks i know so many so many intelligent people from IP, the faculty, the placement, everything is improving. So guys, please do not think that if you don't get the best option, you should not settle for anything else. Because at the end of the day, if you have the determination that even with that average college, you can do good, then you can do good. Okay, so I want you to go and be confident about yourself and believe in yourself. Just because you didn't get a top notch college does not mean that you can't do anything with your life. I mean, come on, you can and you will. Thirdly, this seems like a very gloomy time and you all feel really low and you have these thoughts like, oh, I'm such a useless, I'm such a disappointment. No, I do not want you to think like that and I do not clearly want you to spend your precious time thinking negative thoughts. Right now, you have the time and now you need to be quick and sensible. You need to think about alternatives, okay? Okay, fine. If not this, then what? You need to be sensible and wise right now. You need to research on all these other colleges you are getting, the faculty, how is the placement, maybe get in touch with a couple of seniors. Just randomly go and start talking to some people from, on Facebook, find somebody from that very particular college, talk to them, put on the shameless cap, okay? Do your research because that is what is going to get you a good college. Fourthly, I do not know if you have heard about this, but the more you think positive, the more positive stuff you attract into your life. Yes, you guys are going to be like, dude, we're not even getting a college. How are we supposed to think positive? I know it's tough, but if you just do it, I'm sure it's going to work out for you. And trust me, thinking negative, is that helping? Crying, is that helping? Cribbing, is that helping? No, then why not stay positive about things? That just might work. You will not know anything unless and until you try it out. So I just want you guys to be a little positive and just put on a smile and think that it's all going to fall into place. Because guess what? It is. I promise you everything is going to fall into place. And most probably, not most probably, I'm sure that around 90% of you people are going to go for masters. So how about right now we do it from a normal college and then we study and we do a lot of hard work and then we get into an amazing university for our masters and then 10 years down the lane when you are doing that amazing job and getting paid amazingly then i don't think your college would matter what would matter is what you would remember is the stress that you were having right now and everything so just get it out of your head be happy about it and uh, just please be positive 
Lastly, I think you should just go on the internet and read a couple of stories about people who have uh, graduated from normal colleges and still have made it to really, really amazing places in life. And that would probably inspire you a little bit. Also, I'm always there. If you want, you can completely come and talk to me. And uh, just, I thought you guys should know. I wanted to do journalism. I still want to do journalism. And I got journalism in Kamala Nehru in Delhi University uh, which is the second best college for journalism I wanted to get into LSA but I'm still 0.75% short for LSA and the third list is not out yet I'm hoping it will be just in case it is I will be updating you guys and I want you guys to keep updating me and be happy and just be stress free and uh, also if you want to talk to someone I'm always open you can DM me on Instagram as it exists underscore is underscore shalu or you can like my page on uh, and message me on mrs shalu on facebook or you can just put it in the comments below or you can directly message me on youtube i am always there you guys can come talk to me or talk to anyone talking helps so get it out of your system and just all the best i hope you guys make it well even if you don't get into the top notch amazing i've said top notch a lot of times but anyway, you get my point. So even if you don't get into the A1 college, it's okay. And you are going to be okay. And I promise, promise that everything is going to fall into place. Watch will help to everybody. And yeah, take care. See you soon.